four of us. So yeah, thanks. This is gonna be great. Here we go. I believe in you. You got this. <laughs> Everything that lives is designed to end. We are perpetually trapped in a never-ending spiral of life and death. Is this a curse? Or some kind of punishment? I often think about the god who blessed us with this cryptic puzzle, and wonder if we'll ever have the chance to kill him. Uh, damn! To be... Why? Why did you- A wide, white sword penetrates Nines' stomach. As delicate, red blood drips down him. You attempted to access highly confidential information. Therefore... B but... To be... Trust... Me... Nines' vital signs begin to fade. Heart rate decreasing. Body temperature declining, motor functions failing, pupils dilating. As every one of his parameters breaks down, he chokes out his final words. It hurts. It hurts. Pod 153 to 2E. Proposal. Delete 9S's personal data and reinstall default personal data. This is... too much. <laughs> Yorha Unit number 2, Type E. Unit 9S's... <laughs> actions of obtaining se sensitive information from the bunker were within the predictions. Model number two, Type E's duties, include the punishment of such actions. Number two, Type E should have understood that this mission's outcome was already determined, and acted accordingly. Question. Requesting current status of Unit number two, Type E, who, despite the predicted events, has yet to complete the given mission. SHUT UP ALREADY! In addition, emotions are prohibited for Yorha units. Proposal. Halt the expression of emotions. Terminate Unit 9S's current personal data and reinstall- I TOLD YOU TO SHUT UP! <sighs> April 6th. My name's 9S, Yorha Unit Number 9, Type S. Us scanner models make use of our abilities in order to gather information on certain areas, as well as obtain data on our enemies, the machine life forms. Sometimes we make use of our hacking abilities too, but combat's never really been our forte. We usually work alone though, but even so, we're able to be useful to the rest of our fellow Yorha units. Or, that's what I like to think. My name is 2B. Yorha Unit Number 2 Type B is the name I'm operating under. Type B models specialize in combat. We are a type of unit deployed to the front lines whenever an intense battle breaks out. As a result, we feel nothing at the thought of throwing our lives away. That's just how we were created. I wouldn't hesitate for even a moment to give my life in battle. But after meeting you, 9S, I... After being partnered with 2B, I've had to fight a lot more often than I used to. She just gets into more and more dangerous situations all the time. Just watching her makes me nervous. As a scanner model, I'm only able to equip one type of weapon at a time, so it's not easy for me. But even if it's hard, I'm just happy to be by her side. I'm... not alone anymore. It almost feels like... I have a family. 
They knew even from the design stages that the 9S model's observational skills would be exceptionally high. So they had already foreseen that he'd someday attempt to access Project Yorha's confidential data. My official designation is 2E, number 2 Type E. From the moment 9S gains illegal access within the bunker, it becomes my duty to carry out his execution. It's a duty that I must repeat, over and over, without end. I'd be lying if I said I didn't feel something special towards 2B. But that sort of thing isn't allowed for us Yorha troops. Over and over, I continue to kill 9S with my own hands. And every time, it feels like a void within me deepens. I wonder if it's okay for me to hope. For the day... For the day... When, when my, my sins, sins can, can be, be forgiven. forgiven. Unit 9S's death and deletion of current personal data confirmed. Memory banks completely eliminated. Beginning installation of default personal data. January 18th. So, uh... I guess this is the commercial facility. Yeah. Seems like the people of the old world were able to get a lot of shop shopping done here. And even if they didn't buy anything, they still had a good time just looking at everything. According to the rec records, they refer to that as window shopping? Man, humans sure are weird creatures. Hey, why don't we try it someday? Window shopping. We're soldiers created solely for the purpose of fighting. We don't need useless things like shopping. Once we eradicate the machine life forms, us soldiers won't have anything left to do. We'll enter a new age of peace. I'm talking about for when that happens. I bet it'll be fun. Hmm. When that day comes, I'm all for it. That's what she said as she turned her back to me and began walking. Almost like she was embarrassed or something. Almost like she was sad. Later, we spent a day fishing together in the flooded city. Well, we were actually investigating some marine resources, but we couldn't manage to catch the fish we needed. There wasn't a lot of talking. We just spent the day fishing, watching the gentle waves in front of us. The salty, humid wind blew against us. The surface of the water sparkled brilliantly. I remember all those little details, even now. But the memory that sticks out to me the most happened in the city ruins. It was right after we'd finished our current mission. I went and provoked a wild boar, and it ended up chasing the two of us around the whole rest of the day. We didn't have any information on creatures that were more powerful than the machine life forms we were always fighting, so we had to retreat to the top of a building to get away from it. And while we talked about whether the collection of data for wild boars should take priority over the collection of data for machine life forms, we sat atop that ruined building, covered in plant life, looking out over the rest of the city. Plant and animal life has increased since the old world, but some things haven't changed at all, like the smell of crisp air or the sound of rain. But those are all just a part of my most precious memory. We went around to a whole bunch of places together. Er, for our missions, of course, not for fun. We were always running into some sort of trouble, like intense fights with huge machine life forms. But for me, the memories that stuck with me the most weren't the ones having to do with those battles. But instead, they were just the ones where Tubi and I spent our time doing insignificant things. Those memories are going to disappear soon, like all the rest, along with my personal data. But this me is just happy to have gotten to spend those days with you. Goodbye, to be.
January 18th. Unit 9S's death and deletion of current personal data confirmed. Memory banks completely eliminated. Beginning installation of default personal data. I see. Because Unit 9S continuously carries out illegal access to confidential data, he must be terminated repeatedly. However, during this confrontation, there was little resistance detected from Unit 9S. Further, according to his memory banks, he was aware of Unit 2B's true designation as an executioner model. Question. Why did Unit 9S not resist? 9S knew that I was an executioner model? <laughs> Odd 153, you... you could never understand 9S. Negative. This is the tactical support unit assigned to Unit 9S. This unit is with him during operation hours, as well as during maintenance. This unit is also responsible for reporting when he accesses the bunker's data illegally. It can be inferred that this unit is aware of all information regarding Unit 9S. Therefore, the claim that this unit could never understand 9S is inappropriate. You don't know a single thing about 9S. You and me both. February 4th. No. Enough already. Proposal. Unit 2B should carry out her assignment. I don't want to kill him anymore. Negative. Unit 2B's assignment is still in effect. The commander has already denied the mission cancellation request submitted 64 hours ago. Why do I have to? Report. Unit 2B was modeled after a Yorha test model who was the last surviving member of her group. Unit 2B was chosen due to her ability to adapt to harsh environments as well as her combat capabilities. I'm not suited for this mission at all. Negative. Someone... help me. Negative. Report. Proposal. Destruction. Order. Punishment. Humanity. Moon. Fiction. Machine. Boy. Conviction. Nines! Us Yorha units only exist to be destroyed. Over and over. We die, and we're just reborn again. A lot like the cycle of life and death that living creatures have. But why does my chest always feel so heavy? How come every time I lose my life, I end up feeling like something important was taken from me? Hey, 2B, will I ever be able to see you again? Why does losing my current self make me feel so lonely? Us Yorha units only exist to destroy. In order to recapture Earth and restore humanity, I'll harbor no regrets. Even if I must kill my fellow androids. But killing 9S like this over and over... It feels like I just keep staining my heart with more and more dirty blood. And no matter how much I try to wipe it off, it won't disappear. The heaviness of 9S's words just keeps getting worse. Oh, shit. 
There it is. Hey. Nine S. I wonder. Are the choices I made wrong? Called me nines at the very end, huh? Why? Why did you activate your own self destruction? If you do that, your personal data will. Due to a self administered physical virus, 9S's body begun, had begun to collapse on itself. His hair, his fingertips, his arms. They all felt the intense pain of decomposition. It's okay, to be. You were assigned to... to kill me, weren't you? I... I knew how much it hurt you to have to do this. The hand he was attempting to stroke Tubi's cheek with no longer existed. If it's for you, Tubi, I, I'd easily throw my life away. He attempted to squeeze even the smallest bit of hope out of his collapsing body. Nines, how could you? Tubi, I... No, you are a unit number nine, type S. I have been truly honored to fight by the side of unit number two, type B. May your future battles shine brightly. To be, I... I have a final request. If you and I meet again, I... I want it to be you who kills me. D promise? <laughs> you sure are kind to be. 9S's voice began to fade. The towns, amusement parks, and oceans, we saw together. I'll never forget them. His eyes no longer hold any light within them. Thank you for being with me, Tubi. Everything that lives is designed to end. They are perpetually trapped in a never-ending spiral of life and death. Even if the pain of killing Nine S is the sin I must bear. Even if the joy of meeting 2B is my reason to live. I'll still resist. I'll keep fighting. Even, Even if, if that, that means going, going against, against God. God. End Act 1.